What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Tony D2 Wild, checking in once again. Tony Digital bringing back another 4K visual, back with another banger today, guys, on the Jordan 1 Crimson Tent. <sighs> Set to release on April 13th, we have here the Jordan 1 Crimson Tent. <laughs> Side note guys, shameless plug, the Sample Industries construction pack will be dropping tonight at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I don't know if I'm gonna be dropping this video at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time or 8 p.m. Depending on whatever time it is, this thing is live right now. Go and check it out. I will link it down below in the description. But guys, we have here the Jordan 1 Crimson Tint set to release on April 13th. And these things are already reselling for $300 plus on other resale sites like StockX, Go, and SneakerCon app. In all honesty, the shoe overall, I'm gonna say it's dope, but on the second half, I don't see what all the fuss is about. Now I'm meaning that when I'm talking about the resale value on the shoe, the quality on this shoe is is amazing. I mean, the tumbled leather on here is like an old man's nut sacks after 80 years of basking in the sun with grease oil on your nuts. And I mean, it's very, very tumbled. It reminds me a lot of the Jordan 11, 72, and 10 that we saw as far as like that leather and that tumbledness to it. However, it's not as plush. Now on the Top part, it is plush. It reminds me a lot of that 72 and 10, but here it's not as plush. It's a little bit more stiff, but it is very, very tumble. Another shoe it kind of reminds me of is the Jordan 1 Bread and the Jordan 1 Royal. If you remember that the blacks on that was very smooth, like a regular grain, but the tumbleness on the red and blue on the toe box, as well as up here, was more of a tumbled leather and kind of mimics that a little bit when, you know, filling the shoe. So overall, the quality, I got to give it a thumbs up and the retail is $160 just like any other shoe. However, what kind of gets me and kind of, you know, makes me feel a little bit uncertain about the shoe, like owning it in the long run is the color. I thought this would be more of a cream, but it's more of a pink. It's in between cream and pink. It has more of a like a skin tone to it. It's almost like a very, very pale skin tone and it is pink though, like from looking on here, like looking at it differently, like looking at it from, I can see cream. And then if I do it like this, I can see pink. It's like one of those, like it's the dress, you know, blue or was it blue and black or white and gold. It's like one of those. It has a lot of cream look to it, but you can still see the pink because it's not as pink as the Just Dawn 2s that dropped in that pink colorway. It's a little bit more lighter if that, and it's, it's almost blending into that cream. So overall though, I think the shoe is like, clean is dope but i just don't know if this is something that i can just have for years to come like i don't know if i have that many colors in my collection that will match this that i can rock it with i'll be more, rocking more you know stuff with black than anything but overall i mean if this is something that you like and you want to just know quality wise if it's a good thing to jump the gun on i'm going to definitely say that you're going to be happy so if you like this shoe if you like the color once you get it in the hand you're going to like the shoe even more because you know how sometimes you know you may like the pictures but once you get them in hand the material just throws you off like very similar with me was like the jordan one culture culture once i saw that that shoe I loved it but when I got it in hand I was very very disappointed with it and I didn't even keep that shoe that long because it just disappointed me but I can definitely say that you're gonna definitely like this shoe if you are wanting to get your hands on it the shoe comes with two sets of laces one is that hyper tint crimson and the other one is this green I don't even know where they got that from or what is going on who picked it but once again it's just jordan brand and their design is being really you know slow on the box it says black crimson tint white Nior blanca nuance papura so there's no color suggestions as far as what this color is i don't know what the hell this is this is like some straight reggie kush on here and there's no such thing as reggie kush and then lastly on the inside of the sole the insole it's like a pink inside there so there's really no storytelling behind this shoe as far as what I've seen on the internet. I don't know where they got this color from, where it came from. You know, I know in the month of March, I believe it was National Women's Week, or Women's Month, I believe the month of March was. It would have been dope to drop something like this type of color maybe for that. But I, I just don't know where the storyline, where the thought process is for the shoe. And right now, that's why it's called the Jordan 1 Crimson Pink. Maybe as time goes on, maybe there's something like some weird name to it. The uh, I don't know what the hell this shit look like to tell you what it is. Overall, as stated, if you like the colorway, you're gonna love the shoe in hand because the material is very nice. Inner sock liner has a neoprene type of feel, not your regular type of, you know, just cottony look to it. The tongue is all normal, toe box, everything is normal. And then the bottom, you have that cream, crimson tint, hyper tint, whatever the hell you wanna call it. 
So, let me know you guys' thoughts and opinions down below in the comment section, whether or not you're gonna be grabbing this shoe. Let me know if you like this setup for reviews. I like this table, I finally found the proper angle to make this thing pop and make the panties drop on a girl's bop. You feel what I'm saying? So I'm liking how it's looking. I'm liking how the, the room is coming to. You know, I can just say, Alexa, turn the lights blue. Alexa, turn the lights blue. And she just does what she wants to do. I like her. I like her like that. Alexa, turn the lights red. Yeah, so, yeah, I like it. I like it a lot. So yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you slap a like, comment down below, subscribe to the channel if you're new. And we're gonna end it off with the on foot on these Jordan 1 Hyper Crimson Tints. And uh, yeah, comment down below your thoughts and opinions. I love you guys. It's your boy Tony D2 Wild. Checking in, checking out. Peace.